Today I'd like to show you how to make an airsoft gun. What you're going to need is airsoft pellets, a hose, a bottle, a drill, and an air gun. You're going to want to unscrew the end of the air gun and try to get it in the bottle. I used a pair of scissors to hold it in the bottle. And then once you got it in the bottle, you're going to want to screw the air gun back on. Next you're going to want to cut a piece of the hose for the length of the bottle and drill a hole in the cap and you want to put the holes inside the cap like so and then I use a female coupling at the end and I screwed it onto the cap just to keep it secure on there and make sure that it's real tight because you don't want any air getting through and it's gonna look like this perfect once you got your holes put in the end of the cap you want to cut the length of the holes and you don't want it too long, you want to make sure that there's a little bit of room before the end of the bottle there. So mine was too long, so I cut it down a little bit. I plugged in my compressor, and there's my finished product ready to go. So nothing came out, that really sucked. So I had to go back to the drawing board. I went back to the store and I purchased myself a brake line, a 6 inch, 6 millimeter brake line which is perfect size for the, the airsoft pellets and I put it in my cap and I screwed on the coupling. So I used some hot glue to uh, seal the brake line because it had a little bit of air leaking through. So now that I have the brake line inside the bottle, it works much better. Uh, you gotta remember that you gotta fill the bottle at least half full with the uh, airsoft pellets because you really need the, the bottle filled up for it to work. And my compressor is kind of a little weak. If I had a stronger compressor, it would work much better.